let's get started. Before I opened my doors to Guardians, I watched you thrash through your collective existence. Loss never so much as hindered your destructive stride. The Red War, a vanguard's death, mere hiccups. Back then, I judged you as callous. I assumed it was easy for you to rebuild, because your condition makes you incapable of caring about anything ephemeral. Now, I find myself in a dark hour, and I must admit I am envious of your tenacity. The Black Armory was founded to stand against the coming shadow, but when the darkness returned and our defenses faltered, my work made no difference. Humanity's focus shifted to the stars, and now the forges are gone. If I hope to maintain the Armory's legacy, it's clear I must build something new. The fallen refugees who fled Europa tell of some unfinished Braytech research on matter programming. I believe it could be a new start for the Armory. I've used the Vanguard network to download as much as I can, but some branches can't be accessed remotely. And Europa remains a dangerous front for the Lightless. I need you to enter the Braytech facilities and download the data manually. Look for a terminal with elevated access protocols. There might be one in the nearby offices. I'm receiving data now. Oh, this is incredible work and well annotated. So that's how they solved for diatomic partitioning and the macro fusion blending is just... <clears throat> Apologies. It's just exciting to see the final pieces in front of me. There's a component listed here, some sort of processing unit to calculate the threading algorithms. Looks proprietary. See if your ghost can scan for it based on these parameters. I doubt we'll be able to recreate another one, and none of this will work without it. Yes, that's it! Meet me back in the armory hall, and we'll see what this puzzle looks like when finished. Greetings. Incredible. I felt confident in my interpretation of their schematics, but to see it actually working is something else entirely. When I used to think about the armory, about my responsibility to it, the weight was almost unbearable. Even in this body, I felt like I could never get enough air. Now, for the first time in a long while, I feel relieved and eager. The synth we've produced by this prototype won't provide combat effectiveness, but I will continue to explore possible applications. Perhaps Ikora could use it for disguising her hidden. With more tensile strength, it could reduce maintenance time on Red Jacks. I, I don't know what discoveries lie ahead, but I'm eager to find them. Thank you, Guardian. I can't express what this means to me. Now, shall we give it a try? <laughs> <laughs> 